Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to JGL Gaming and welcome back to your boy, Emperor, oh, Emperor Diederik, the monk of Frankia. <laughs> yes, uh, we, we're starting to really look good on the map there. I think we are one of the biggest fonts in the world right now, which is what it's all about, right? <laughs> the size of the lettering, that's what the Paradox games are all about. Fatimids or Seljuks are doing better than us, but... You know, in the West, in the West, we're, we're, we're doing well. All right. <laughs> last time we became the, the Emperor of Francia. Uh, last time uh, we, we, we installed our son as Duke of Flanders. Uh, this time our goal is still to uh, change to Prime Minister in France. And also, uh, something that I was sort of mulling over uh, between the recording of last episode and, and this episode, is that uh, I kind of want uh this kit to inherit because then it meant it means we can press weak claims on the kingdom of england so that would be great then we can maybe take the whole kingdom in one fell swoop so let's try that let's try to kill this guy uh what's his name oswin the just the Comte feel yeah he's no longer um yeah so we, we've had uh six generations of the normandies who ruled for uh about 60 years a little bit less but now the Comte feels are back. Oh, that's great. Well, it's not great. Actually, good point, actually. Because um, it says here that the heir is, is Prince Wolfhelm, but I don't think that's true, is it? No. Damn it. It's this, this guy is the heir of, of the Kingdom of England. So it doesn't matter if we kill him, because there will be another male, uh, adult male on the throne. So we still cannot press any claims. Hmm. So we really need someone with a strong claim. Um, and I don't quite know. It needs to be, I guess, someone who is the top three here. So it Boutros Ibn Gabriel Jimena. This guy has already a weak claim, but he needs a strong claim. Hmm. It makes it tricky. It does make it tricky. Hmm. I guess, yeah, I guess... Hmm. I, was, I was hoping if we killed this guy, we could take the whole kingdom, but I don't think that's possible. What about the Kingdom of Brittany? Is there anyone with a strong claim yet? That we can press. Because if we press the claim on this kingdom, then we just vassalize the whole kingdom again in, in, in one, one take. Let's look if we have someone like that. I don't think so. They're already being attacked. Breton Holy War for Leon. And the King is uh, the King of Wales is attacking him. Okay. I suppose we have to do this the old fashioned way. Is there any, like, duchy we can take in one go? This 82-year-old woman has a claim. Uh, what about this duchy? Duchy of Penchev. Any claim is here? We claim. We claim. No, it's all we claims, right? Oh, this guy is a strong claim. But she is the, the Count of Penchev, so she is underneath the Kingdom of Brittany anyway, so we cannot press a claim for her. Anyone else with a strong claim? No, right? Hmm. This girl has a strong claim, though. Duchy of Penchevre. Do you want to join me at court? He does. What are your claims, man? County of Leon. No, we don't care about that. We care about your wife's claim. He's, uh, his sibling is the Count of Leon. Okay. Why don't you come over here? Jihad for Africa. There's no concern of ours. Uh, I've spent many nights looking at the stars in our observatory. It's really fascinating. So many questions to ask. Alright. I accept your gracious invitation. Alright. Uh, we're going to immediately kill you. Because <laughs> we, uh, we, uh, we want your wife uh, to marry... Matrilinia, do we actually? Does it matter? Let's see. Uh, where's your family tree, uh, girl? Am I crazy? <laughs> okay, thanks. Uh, what about your family tree? Okay, you are there. This girl just does not have a family tree. Interesting. Okay. She does have parents though. Maybe they... No. Hmm. Something's bugging out here, I think. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Well, whatever. <laughs> uh, doesn't matter so much. Yeah, I was, I was, I was thinking, does, does it matter if we... 
Uh, if we if we divorce, do we need to divorce these guys, or will the okay? The, so sibling is already the Duke of Penchevre, but he will lose it. This guy's a count. Okay, so I, I think it's fine. I think we can press it. So let's do that immediately. Claim Penchevre. Hoppa. Yeah, we really need to start expanding. We had a we had a peaceful uh, time uh, last time, but uh, you know. We need to expand. We need to rival the HRE. We are still making claim on Dutch of, uh, country of Paris, right? Yeah. Great. My acquaintance died a sickly infant. Wiegeetje. Okay. I don't care. We have a, a child, a kinsman. Gerold. Gerold Albrecht's son. Oh uh, yeah, my son. Why not? All right. Uh, we have some more people coming. But we will just uh, get a move on. Cherry can lead as a siege leader. My card can be in the flank. And then I guess uh, our kinsman, Charles of Saint Lee. He hates us, I think. Yeah. I think we. Um, no, he doesn't hate us. Okay. I thought we, uh, we, we, we took uh, the title from him. Alright, on the way there. Uh, my co conspirator has produced a venomous viper. Uh, we are trying to kill who? Oh, this guy. <laughs> I was just discussing that with you guys that we don't really need to. Let's cancel the plot and hope that this doesn't succeed. If it does, eh, doesn't matter so much. I would feel a little bit bad, but on the other hand, Diederik is a dick, right? So I don't think he cares at all. <laughs> to Master Diederik, my brother, I have a proposal which might interest you. Vice Rene, Alistair Whisper. Oh yeah, we um, we made her the the vice uh, vice warrior of uh, Valencia. I have a proposal which might interest you. Yeah, uh, sure. We can go after some hermetic texts. Why not? Uh, let us travel to the ruins in Aidhap. In Noba Nobatia. No idea where that is. Let's look that up. Nobatia. Pretty kingdom of Nobatia. Ah, okay. It's in Ethiopia. So sure, we'll go there. No problem. We're not fighting in this war anyway. Yeah, we're another commander, because we really suck at it, so... <laughs> you know, do what you're good at. Do what you love and the money will come. <laughs> it's one of the... Well, I wouldn't say lies, but... One of those sort of comforting things you tell children. I do think it is somewhat important to do what you like, but... In the end, you also need to make money, so... Uh, let's see. You need to uh, make a sort of a uh, what's that called? A compromise in that. All right, let's attack you. Some life lessons there <laughs> in the new year, second of January. Wait, who, who are the is he besieging? Oh, this guy again. Well, I we should have killed him. Oh well, uh, can we can we have our vice Rena take care of that? We need quite a big army because I recall it's all horse archers, right? Okay. Uh, observing the movement of the stars at night, you have begun to see some regular patterns. These observations, however, have raised many new questions. You are starting to wonder, for example, if the, if the Earth is really at the center of it all. Interesting. Oh, I'm diligent. That's good. Won't help with being stressed, but. 22 learning. <laughs> yeah, we, we've, we've, we've got so much, so much good stuff in our in our inventory. We got scholarship focus now. We are well on our way to becoming the uh, uh, the, the grandmaster, I think. Uh, our expedition to foreign lands encountered some difficulties, but in the end, we made it to the ruins of Aidhap safely. After a fortnight of excavation, the servants uncovered the entrance to a hidden underground chamber. Adept Alice and I entered side by side, the air heavy with excitement. Are those hieroglyphs? Oh, great. Yeah, I was gonna say, I, I'm pretty sure we can rank up now. Alright, oh yeah, how is the, uh, yeah, everyone here? Not yet. Need a few more, uh, a few more boats. That's fine. I'm an initiate. Okay, can I now uh, brew the potion? Not yet, I think. Now oh, we need ingredients. 
Okay, let's let's get some ingredients then. Um, I'm a very good diplomat, so that means I think we will be best served uh, going into the marketplace. All right. Uh, let's see. Markart and Cherry and Charles are leading my army uh, elsewhere, so we have these three guys leading it. Okay, let's go. Let's go to Constantinople. Try to save at least something. <laughs> Not have the whole thing burned down, no, else they might they might destroy the Hagia Sophia. We cannot have that. Oh, we put something in there, right? The Neil through cross. Yeah, I remember now. Should we change this name, Hagia Sophia? We name Hagia Sophia. Who like Saint Christopher or? Nah. We have the, the Neil through cross. We could do that like the Holy. The Holy Son, because I I, re I read later that it's one of the so the, uh, the Hagia Sophia it's like the Holy Spirit uh, in in Orthodoxy. So it's one uh, one of the three uh, members of the tri Holy Trinity. Uh, I think it, yeah. So in Western tradition that would be the Holy Spirit. So it's the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Holy Ghost, whatever. Uh, the stalls around us are brimming with all different kinds of goods. All right, the charismatic touch will bring forth the nicest wares. Victory. One child and Echo Focus. My grandson. Okay, we, we're gonna raise him ourselves. We need to have uh, someone good raise him at least. We can raise him ourselves, I guess. But we will, we will raise him, I think, in a, in a good way. Because we need him to be better than we are. I think Diederik is, is starting to turn around a little bit. You know, he's embracing his, his scholarly side. He became diligent. He's working hard. Hopefully uh, bettering himself a little bit, although he's still cruel. And, and cynical, so not uh, not by much. Okay, here are the. Oh, uh, yeah, let's attack the Bretons here. Uh, what about the army of Mayor Godsfolk? I think we will be able to save uh, Black and I. Recently, I've noticed the pitiful state of my daughter, Princess Sigerda. I have just been informed that the causes of her aches and pains is a case of the flu. All right. Uh, we can upgrade. Should we? Should we go for the extensive hospital complex? Or should we? Should we go for other stuff? Hmm. What? Uh, what difference would it make? Let's see. It's a bit of a waste of points, really. But this is another twenty-five percent, right? So it's now 50% and it will be... Okay, so that's a huge difference. Yeah. Oh, and it costs 5,000 gold, so we won't be able to afford it anyway. So I think I'm going to go for something else. Uh, let's do improved keeps. And... Yeah, I don't care so much about cities and temples. Castle Town 4, that's good. Yeah, let's do that. Let's build Castle Towns. And up upgrade, increase our, our tax revenue. Let's wait for a while, because we're at war right now. We may need the money to hire some mercs. Alright. Uh, come on, save, save Constantinople, guys. There we go, attack. Uh, the defenders of Saumur launched an unsuccessful raid against the besiegers, taking heavy losses in the attempt. Okay, well, we're here to rescue them. Let's see. We are we're fighting the king of Brittany himself, who's a pretty good marshal. I think. Yeah, pretty good. And a couple of other Bretons. We should win this, right? What about the fight in... Okay, we're winning this also. Great. We saved we saved your asses, guys. You should be thankful. Yeah, we can... We can uh, disband this. Research you're conducting your observatory at night is proving deeply fascinating. You could push your studies further, but you need to purchase more equipment. Sure. All right, fifty-seven percent for the Britain Breton War. The keep has been built in Amsterdam. Oh, yeah, we're still upgrading that. We should keep doing that. Four alchemical ingredients. Great. Slipping by the stalls, I nearly every single one of them has an interesting item. I merely poke Faisren Alice to make her aware of it, and she puts on the smooth talking. After her haggling, people almost end up. After her haggling, people almost end up end up giving us the items for free. 
how did we end up with so many things? I guess, and yeah, I'm, I'm saying it's her, but I think it's more me. So I am super diplomatic. I'm like uh, the best smooth talker in the world. Four chemical ingredients. Great. Now we can. Yes, brew potion of eudaimonia. Good demon. Something. Eudaimonia is Greek for good. Daimonia demon. Yeah. Do it. Uh, I might just combine the two. Or I would could throw it all in there. Now let's just combine the two. We can do it again. If we ever get depressed or anything. Some guy was captured in battle. Uh, how are, are we chasing down this guy? Not yet, okay. Yeah, we're gonna destroy him now, because he's been he's been skulking around our lands for so long. He, uh, I think, he, yeah, he burned down a couple of things here as well. Sixty-three percent. Uh, I feel different, lighter. I brewed the potion just like the enciphered recipe dictated. Mere seconds after it passed my lips, a wave of pleasurable sensations rolled over me. While the peak of my bliss was short-lived, that first rush must have washed away the dispiriting darkness that has plagued me for so long. I lose Fritz rest. Okay. Now we're doing well now. Okay, let's attack this guy again. Can we um, can we take these? Or is it not? Uh, are we not hostile to him? We can check that, right? No, we're not. Okay. What about here? Oh, he's attacking us again. Uh, Bulgarian invasion of Greece on King Simon of Greece. The Bulgarian band. 2k troops versus his 8k. He'll be fine. We don't need to help him. Captured in battle, a duke. The Duke of Penchevre himself. Okay, great. We will keep him for a while, I think. Because uh, he will be a troublesome vessel otherwise. All right, and yeah, we're gonna kill him. Stop raiding our lands, man. We need to set an example to you guys. Uh, all right, uh, can we? Oh, we cannot attack. Okay. Here come the f the, the Welsh. <laughs> oh, oh, sorry, I I, f I didn't see you. Who's of legal age? Umar, Umar is of legal age. Okay, we can almost marry the Queen of Akitan. Who is our, our ward, right? Oh, not anymore? I thought we made her our ward. I'm almost sure of it. Hmm. Let's try again then. And I kinda want I kinda want her to become Dutch also. Alright, let's besiege this other county. And slowly expand a little bit. Yeah, I was I was still hoping that we could that, that like a kid would would go, would, uh, would be on the throne of England, but they do have a new king, I guess. But uh, we still cannot press weak claims, I guess. Have we said in Normandy? Oh, that's a girl, a steamy wear. Hmm. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna kill him, right? Would be great if because if it, if it's a girl, we can press a weak claim, and we have I think a couple of people with with weak claims. I know this is last time. We also have this guy. Who is our vessel already, and he also has a weak claim on the Kingdom of England. So if we press it for him, then uh, you know he's the grand the grandfather of uh, King Thor of the Wise and also of <laughs> Zhao Wenzong, <laughs> who is the I don't know. Holy <laughs> Jesus, Jesus Christ! <laughs> Welp. Good going. <laughs> Good going, uh, man. I guess he's the Emperor of China, right? Probably. It doesn't uh, doesn't uh, seem to work. Because my game is a little bit buggy today. And hopefully it will solve itself. It doesn't say uh, what his title was. Anyway. Uh, oh, we are still fighting. That shouldn't forget to... Uh, I don't know. You're not going anywhere, man. Medium Crown Authority? Nope. He did finally, finally pass Light Crown Authority. The same time that it took us to... There we go. Okay. That's the end of the host. That's the end of the, the host that was raiding our lands for so long. We've defeated them. And now to move on to other things. Okay. Uh, 54. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna try to sway this guy. Maybe he will want to join us later. 
We're gonna bribe a couple of people. Uh, 52 is a bit much. We're gonna bribe you. We're gonna bribe you. How many percent will this be? And I just hope that uh, she will be the top, uh, the top uh, air. Uh, long enough. Yeah, it's still her. I wish to know Mandy. Right. And then that we can kill him fast enough. So that we can press the... Uh, the... Uh, the claim. You guys, we're gonna... Uh, we're gonna drive you anyway. Because we need... We need... Uh, we need to kill him as fast as possible. What can I possibly uh, do to endear Major Petra to me? I'm not particularly experienced in making people like me. I mean, I have 27 diplomacy, so I disagree with that. <laughs> but it cannot be that hard. Isn't there a bard mocking him in Holland? I'll teach him how to deal with his enemies. I mean, he's arbitrary, right? Teach him how to deal with his enemies. Many terrifying ways. Yeah, I, isn't there a bard mocking him somewhere in Holland? Yeah, he loved me. <laughs> Chiefs have been a bit put off by my thoughtful presence. Nevertheless, he, he thanked me for taking the time to prepare it. How nice of him. How nice of you, man. We're gonna give you a bit of money also. Yeah, maybe when it gets to 100, we will be able to, uh, to, to encourage him to join our plot. There we go. 97% still not 100, huh? Uh, my ward, Rosela, was bitten by a snake this morning. That's my last. <laughs> he was crowned by the Pope himself, then. Was I crowned by the Pope? No, I was not crowned by anyone. I did have an extravagant coronation. Oh, no, I was, I was crowned by the Pope. Anastasius IV. Alright. What are my vessels doing? They don't like me so much. Ah, my co-conspirator, Baron Rotber Rotbert, has hired someone to saw through the supports of the railing on the balcony that King Marcus is known to have Look out below. Man, this would be great. We almost won this war. Yep, 100%. Thank you very much. That's great. Yep, we got a, we got a little chunk of Brittany there. Gonna continue doing that. Uh, hopefully, uh, we will annex the whole kingdom of Brittany at some point. Unlanded sun still. Yeah, we have nothing to give you at the moment, uh, guys. Sorry. Uh, can we imprison someone? Maybe. Now let's let's wait for this plot to uh, fire or not fire. Failure. Damn it. Carpenter will use was detained and revealed my revealed my involvement in the torture. Damn it. Okay, well, we have to try again, I guess. My little grandson, Diederik, always has his nose in the scriptures and spends all his time among priests. Such a bright little child. I will not raise a salad. I mean, I am scholarly, so I think I would approve of him reading, even if it's not really the kind of thing that I enjoy. I'm cynical. I would prefer him to be like, uh, to read like scholarly stuff. But hey, such a bright little child. I lost the trade cynical now. Okay, so I'm only paranoid and cruel. <laughs> no longer cynical. Or maybe I'm a bit, bit less of a dick now. On a courtesy visit to the abbot of a local monastery, you observe a group of monks translating beautiful, be beautifully illustrated books into your language. I will buy a few books. Perhaps I'll even read them. Yep. Definitely. How much money are we making? 35 gold. Nice. Although I think... Uh, where is it? Okay, we do have some field of taxation. Oh yeah, we had uh, inheritance law. Good point. Good point, Jan. <laughs> uh, still not 10 years. I thought it was 10 years already. Kingdom of France. 23rd of November. 1229. Should be right. Oh no, it was this. Uh, it was the, the emperor empire that was the problem. Yeah, okay, so we're, we're far from. We're still 6 years off. That's fine. I, I, I'm less worried about it now because I think we will we will still keep the kingdom, uh, regardless. Uh, because we we are an emperor, so uh, one of our other sons might inherit the kingdom of France, but it will still be. Uh, I think it will, he will still be our vessel, and if not, we will have strong claim on it, so we can we can just reconquer it. 
That is the pitiful state of my daughter, Princess Sigerda. Call my composition. Who is my composition, actually? Fadul. Man, he's terrible. We should replace him. We really should. Can we just resign him? Revoke honorary title court position. Yep. I want to hire a new court position. Because he sucks. <laughs> Can we, uh, what about this guy? Does he love us already? Not quite yet. Can we give him an artifact, maybe? No, I don't really want to give him any of this. It's not really worth it. Weeping statue, maybe. Nah, 5% tax modifier is also not worth it. We'll just, uh, we'll just keep swaying him. Uh, we got this guy. Sadadin, Sadadin. Sure, bring him to me. 65 gold. Jeez. No thanks. We can get a better one for less gold. <laughs> if we do it like this. Uh, where about the there? Here we go. A Sardinian guy. Who is Waldensian. A Scottish guy with a Castilian guy. Now let's get the Sardinian guy. Mr. Ponzu. Why don't you come over here, man? We're gonna make you our uh, our core position. We could also just make um, the vice. I uh, know oh we cannot do that. I guess we cannot make uh, make this girl our uh, our core position. No. Oh well. Not because she's a woman, I guess. There we go. Welcome, sir. Petra, swaying. Ah, you are committed. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Success! Ah, the story cannot concoct it about a lone bowman. Seems to be working perfectly. Alright, fantastic. Yep, it's a girl. Can we press the... Yeah, we can! Oh, that's so awesome. This is. We can even press it for uh, one of our, uh, our family members. Man. Yeah, no, oh, he's terrible. <laughs> he is terrible. We have to press it for one of our vessels, right? Because otherwise, uh, it will not be. Um, we will not. We can press it for this this guy, the Anjou, or for this guy. This, this is a pretty good guy. He's already uh, used to being a ruler. He's got a decent uh, army of his own. He's already married to the Queen of England. Okay, well, <laughs> that makes it easy, I guess. Matrilineally, well, it doesn't matter so much. All right, let's do that. Can we do it immediately or should we wait? No, no we can do it immediately, I guess. Oh, this is our, is our army 16k, yeah, easily. All right, claim England. <laughs> I just hope, uh, he, uh, because sometimes it's a bit weird with CK2. Uh, I just hope, uh, he will, she will, we will vassalize England this way. I think we should, but you never know. Okay, let's go. And luckily. Yeah, this is all de jure England territory, so we can uh, we can uh, easily occupy it. We don't have we don't even have to use boats. Let's go to Rouen. Proposal uh, detail uh, blah, blah blah. Sure, why not? We're not gonna spend a lot of money though. Two eight, eighteen gold. Nah. Let's go to Lusignan. All right, here we go. Everyone pile pile into this guy. A blessed has passed. You stash the betun. Married to my rival. I don't know why she's my rival. No, I really don't. Okay, doesn't matter. That should be his name. Maybe we killed uh, the kid? No. Yeah, we did. No. I <laughs> don't even... Ah, okay, she's... She's an ex... Cause she's the, the mother of... Uh, of a capet that we killed. <laughs> saint in, in heaven. Adalbeth, the miracle worker von Pommen. Alright, another saint. Really uh, having a, a lot of saints here. Huh? Okay, everyone pile in, guys. 12k. Uh, working in your observatory lately, you are often frustrated by broken equipment, weeks on end of cloudy weather, and frequent interruptions by curious intruders and even animals. Uh, it's very hard to maintain concentration and get anything done. I must persist and throw this out there. All right, we're gonna have the, the, the siege guy. Valeria, oh, we have another siege guy. We have two siege guys. Okay, well, let's put them both in. Put me in, coach. There we 
go. Man, I hope this this would be a great addition to our empire. Just the whole kingdom of England would be fantastic. I guess also a couple of guys are coming all the way from Trace, right? Yeah. <laughs> oh well. Oh, and a couple of here. Or just from Tangiers, I guess. Ah, they will be here at some point. We don't need all of them. Oh, I'm depressed. Oh. For a while I felt like nothing could distinguish the renewed sense of joy I gained after drinking the potion. It seems as if I was mistaken. Life and duty wears one down and I am no exception. Damn it. Can we immediately try again? Yeah, okay. <laughs> uh, I might just combine the two. Hope I don't die of depression suddenly. That, that would suck. Yep. <laughs> I brewed the potion just like the enciphered recipe dictated. Mere seconds after it passed my lips, a wave of pleasurable sensations rolled over me. While the peak of my bliss was short-lived, that fine rush must have washed away the dispiriting darkness that has plagued me for so long. <laughs> for like two weeks. <laughs> oh, drugs. We're already addicted to drugs. <laughs> okay, occupy. My trusted and devoted Chamberlain just brought to my attention that one of the serving maids has given birth to a child. According to him, my son is the father. That's my boy. Yeah, that's what I would say, I guess. That's my boy. <laughs> uh, okay, we found Hermetic text. Great. We're doing very well in Hermetics, I think. Yeah, we can almost rank up to Adept, or not almost. We're well on our way. If we hadn't spent all that money, or all, all, all those points on, uh, on, on, on potions, then uh, I can go into hiding. Why? Someone tried to kill me? Who? Who was trying to kill me? Oh, we don't know, I guess. Oh well. No, we're not going to go into hiding. Of course not. Of course not. What are you thinking? Where's uh, where's her army? I have to attack her army. Oh, here, here they come. Okay. Everyone, go north. Go north, young man. Go west, young man. I've always been better at talking through my pen. Maybe the best way to show my good attentions is to dedicate him a poem. Okay, I can. We, we can. Uh, ah, we can do it, I guess. Uh, I already succeeded in, in killing. Uh, so we're gonna stop swaying. Or he succeeded in the plot that I needed him for. Saint in heaven, another one. Saint Paul the understanding. Oh, he's a real saint. Look at this guy. Died of cancer though. And it wasn't. Uh, it's often said that Saint Paul was so understanding of others that he would be able to practically read their minds. All right. Okay, whatever. Everyone move to Bruges. What do you think you're doing, man? This is this is very, very stupid. <laughs> We're gonna destroy you. Bam. Easy, easy fight. Easy fight, easy life. Oh, did we did we not gain the one score from that? Okay, we can. Okay, we don't care so much. Because they attacked, I, I guess, my vessel or something. That's so stupid. Uh, okay, um, Majesty, we can increase, I guess. Uh, our granddaughter is lacking a guardian. A cousin, can she do it? Sure, why not? She's pretty good. Prince Jaco. Well, Prince Jaco, I hope we can give you something soon, but I don't, I don't know if we will. Thirty-three percent. Yep. My grandson Diederik is turning into an ar arrogant little braggart. I might have to rein him in a bit. I go before the fall. No, he has reason to be proud. Yeah, that's what I would say. Uh, my dear Emperor, you've been uh, pursuing uh, studies in the fields that deny the truth of Jesus. The best answer to this is silence. Yep. I'm very diplomatic, right? So I wouldn't just outright say that you know, I don't care what he thinks. Uh, we can imprison still the Vizeran, but we won't because we like her. Or is she the one that's trying to kill me? Could be. <laughs> In that case, yeah, no, she loves us, right? Probably not. Probably she won't be trying to kill us. We can risk it. We really can't, but <laughs> whatever. Uh, I watched my grandson Diederik at play with another child yesterday and noticed he didn't want to share his toys. 
This is our children learn fifth. He needs the birch. He needs lecture on charity. God will save him from hell. Um, well, yeah, I'm cool, right? He needs the birch. Ah, we got some reinforcements coming. We don't really need them anymore, but it's always nice. <laughs> there we go, 42%. Let's go and assault some stuff here. 25k troops. This is really the full... They're in full force. Of the Emperor of Francia. She won't be able to stop us here. 57%. Let's go to here. This is all still, uh, yeah, still the Duchy of Normandy. Or do she, does she get Ticking Wharf score because we don't own her capital? No. Attack. Attack. It's the Blitzkrieg on uh, Normandy here. Alright, I think she's moving back into Holland, yep. Only 2k troops though. No, 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 okay. Uh, some war. Ah, okay, we're attacking her. We should do it, right? Oh, not almost. We're almost there. Just one more fort. And England will be ours. The conquest is going on, yeah. Okay, so much. We, we might we might do that later. Because uh, we are a Spanish uh, king, you know, we own a big chunk of Spain. Uh, your studies of the celestial spheres are progressing well. You see movements and relationships that you had never dared guess at. It seems clear to you now that the laws that guide the movement of the stars must also be reflected on Earth in some way. And what is Earth? Oh, indeed. A Copernicusing, Copernic Copernicusing up in here. Or Galileoing up in here. You know, the more I read about Galileo, the more I think he's kind of a dick. <laughs> he's just he's real prima donna, that guy. He um, he was he was not so much prosecuted for for his work, but more for being a dick to the church. <laughs> I mean, the church did did prosecute him also for his work, but you know, it's it's not as easy as, as sometimes the narrative is. There we go, 100%. Here we go. Okay, off a piece. King Oswin of England gains the Kingdom of England. He's already the King of England, but now he's the real King of England. <laughs> yes. Oh, look at this. Look at this. <laughs> Damn. All right. Did she have five? Oh, we, oh, we got a chunk of Egypt now, of course. Oh, a big chunk. We got so many colonies. <laughs> he is also fighting some someone. Who is he fighting? Abidosian holy war for Finland. <laughs> okay, why? Do you have land there? Does it look like it? I don't know. And just when you're doing big, but look, look at this big blue blob. We are so strong. <laughs> we got England now under our under our belt. What does that do for our levies? Okay, well, it doesn't help that much yet. I think uh, probably, uh, yeah, he still needs to, uh, yeah, he still needs to grow. So it's about 10k extra. Now uh, we get a sort of percentage of that, which would be quite high because he loves us now. Bloodlines, yeah, he's still blooded will in the conquest. So the Normandies are back in power in England. We might, I mean, I don't know if I will do it now, but I'm kind of feeling like just revoking it. Um, and then uh, giving it out as a as a vice royalty, but for now I think he can keep it. Damn! <laughs> Fantastic. Can we claim Leon? Claim Wes? Can we claim another duchy, or is it only counties? No. Okay, we were choose with him anyway. But that's our next goal: was to clean up these borders a little bit. And now what about uh, uh, Lotharingia? Can we press for that? Bra Brabant, Braunschweig. Papal war for Ferrara. Oh, we can reconquer Ferrara for the Papal State. Excommunicated ruler, Paris holdings. Nah. We've not been at war with the HRE for a long time. But I think they fear us by now, right? Yeah, he's, he's only got 20k troops and he's elected. While we are... Uh, 
Well, we're not finding regenerators here everywhere yet, but we are. Uh, we, we our crown authority is a lot higher. I also kind of feel like just giving this guy the kingdom of Thrace, making him uh, uh, a grand prince, because I like that. But we're gonna keep the kingdom for now. It doesn't do any harm, right? Or is it the gavel kind? Oh, it is gavel kind. Okay. Can we can we change the law for that one? The inheritance law? No, we're still we we need to have range for ten years. That will be in a few years, hopefully. It's a nice bonus in prestige, right? It's like plus one prestige or something. Uh, health kingdoms three uh, plus zero point eight prestige per kingdom. Not that we need not that, that, not that we need the prestige really, but <laughs> hey, okay, England, England is under our, our thumb. Fantastic. We can pray the duchy, which is already mentioned. Okay. Oh, we got we got a ton of new wonders. We got Stonehenge. Nah, we cannot we cannot uh, build it. No. So Nench is not damaged. Can we re re repair it even? No, loot. Now we need to be a pagan, right? That's too bad. Uh, well, what else have we got? Lighthouse of Alexandria. Look at the Great Pyramid we have. <laughs> in the de de desert of Giza, the ancient pyramid has for hundreds of years inspired wonders in our visitors. Damn. <laughs> we got so many wonders. Man, we are really blobbing out now, eh? Um, yeah, let's, uh, okay. Oh, actually, yeah, I'm, I'm, in, <laughs> I'm engrossed in this game so much. I didn't look at the recording time, but we've, we've been recording for 46 minutes. So I think with the conquest of England and then <laughs> a little weird bit tacked on at the end there, uh, we can call it today. I think it's a nice, nice place to end because we are really, really, really strong right now. <laughs> we're going to continue expanding the, uh, the holdings of the house girl thing next episode. And we'll see uh, how long uh, how long we continue on with this this game. Uh, so far, I'm still enjoying it, but it could be that at some point we're just too strong. Let's uh, let's see how it goes. Uh, thanks, guys, for watching, and see you next time. Bye bye.